Hi dear students, in this video I will be talking about ISI BSDS crash course. So now BSDS is this very newly launched. So uh, on the basis of the things which I know from the ISI faculties and uh, other different kind of formats that what is going to come on that basis I'm going to do it. First, you need to do, yeah, you know, when you have the cases to anything that in order to give an ISI, you need to have a very good basic. Yeah, obviously that is needed. That if that, that is an added benefit, but here if you don't have it, so I will build it up for you in this short span of time. Okay. I'll try to rather say okay so we'll first we will start with the set relations and functions alongside that um, ISI gives a lot of questions from the complex numbers uh, number system so that we will be doing it in the very first week I do everyday classes will be there and in alternation it will be there so in general six classes and one mock test and uh, then also there are parallel four mock tests will also be given to you so this is the system now now, uh, alongside this, there will be another parallel thing. Uh, they love to give it. There will be a lot of questions come from combinatrix. So, uh, directly after this, we'll jump to after number theory. I will jump to combinatrix. So, you know, combinatrix will be doing it not only the basics, but four types of questions comes in. Like how many zeros at the end, squares within squares, squares within rectangles, that type of question is diagnostic calculation based questions. Third type is um, uh, finding. Uh, zeros factorial based and the fourth is the normal conventional questions okay after this advanced level sequence and remember that this sequence is not only like uh, one two three dot 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 n or one square two square one cube three cube, two cube three cube sometimes they will give you one to the power four one to the power two to the power four in that type sequences advanced sequences and relationship based questions you know uh, a little bit of question can come from like am gm hm inequality after this, we'll directly jump into the limit continuity part in the next week uh, as well uh, and the differentiability part, uh, which is very important. So this all will be done within uh, five to six classes span. And then they have the trigonometry and integral calculus as well, which is uh, a little bit ignored in the ISI start, but here we will not be ignoring them. Okay, so this we will be doing as well. And afterwards, we will proceed to the other part uh, remember that here differential equation basics of the differential equation will be coming okay differential equation not the difference equation and after this uh, uh, in the next uh, week uh, we will go to an advanced method for the coordinate geometry and vector algebra and 3d all together okay so every time i will take a cumulative test of yours means topic one no whenever it is done then topic two when we will be finishing then topic one plus topic two this we will be doing it together okay in that way then comes the linear algebra like the matrix and determinants and that here we will be having the statistics and probability as well so that we will be keeping it till the end and uh, remember that here week wise format i have given you an idea but remember that it depends on the batch and the students capacity i don't believe in the pre-decided uh, things okay they will do it and that and that will be followed i do it only 15 students students two batches so on that basis we will be proceeding okay so this is the scenario for this all the very best feel free to ask me any questions i will be available for you and i will send you the voice messages and i will solve it in uh, you know my sheets and copies like this here okay so whenever anyone sends me any question i solve it like this and send it to you okay so hopefully we will be seeing you soon in the class and let's get started